Hello, I'm Max Jones and this is my board game modification video. If you've ever played chess, you know it's a very strategic game. And if you've ever played chess with a skilled player, you might have felt overwhelmed with how much there is to know about the game. Like, I'm sorry that I use the incredibly predictable and counterable Queen's triple somersault defense. I don't know what that means. If you've ever felt this way, I have the perfect chess mod for you. Welcome to Gambler's Chess. Gambler's Chess is played just like regular chess, but with two main differences. Three chess pieces are chosen at random to change their type, and four tiles are chosen at random to change a piece's type once it's landed on. Say goodbye to getting skill issued by your pro chess friends, and say hello to getting luck issued by your pro chess friends. This is how it works. In the beginning of the game, you draw a card containing two locations, one tile on your side, and one tile on your opponent's side. Next, you draw a card containing the different kinds of chess pieces. This tells you what to change that piece to. Do this three times. Next, draw four cards. These will contain different locations in the middle of the board. Take a chess piece card and lay it face down on that tile. Once a piece lands on the tile, flip that card over to reveal what the piece will change into. In total, you should have 31 tile location cards, 16 for the middle, and 15 for the spawn locations. It is recommended that you have 14 chess piece cards, two of which are queens, and three are the other varieties, not including the king's piece. You can change the level of randomness and style of your game by changing how many chess piece cards you have. As an optional way to play, you can choose to draw location tile cards every four rounds until you run out of chess piece cards. If you draw a card and a king is on the tile that was drawn, discard that card and do not redraw. Kings cannot land on tiles with a chess piece card on them, and said tiles will count towards putting a king in the check state. This mod is designed to really spice up your games with some randomness and deviate from the well-explored standard chess. I hope you enjoy.